your guide to constellations, deep sky objects, planets, and events. Tonight's sky, highlights of the September sky. If you have a clear view to the west, you might be able to spot Venus hanging low over the horizon right after sunset. Catch a quick look through a telescope if you can. After nightfall, Look for Mars and Saturn in the southwestern sky. The two planets will move farther apart as the month progresses, with Saturn setting well before Mars in late September. Use a telescope to get a better view of the planets before they dip below the horizon. September nights feature the wet quarter of the sky. Two neighboring constellations bear ancient references to water. Aquarius is one of the oldest constellations, recognized even by early civilizations. In ancient mythologies, Aquarius is the god of the waters. Look for the water jar, a group of stars shaped like a Y. A rich, compact cluster of stars can be seen in Aquarius. Known as M2, it contains about 150,000 stars located about 37,500 light years away. Binoculars present it well, but a small telescope reveals much more detail in the cluster's compact center. Nearby lies the great constellation Capricornus. Known in mythology as the water goat, it represents a creature that fed and watered the infant Zeus, ruler of the Greek gods. Algeti is the brightest star in Capricornus. It's visible in binoculars as an elongated star. This odd shape is due to a visual trick. From our distant vantage point, two unrelated stars appear to be close together. Capricornus also hosts a dense cluster of stars, M30. A small telescope easily resolves individual stars in the cluster. Late in the month, dim Mercury makes a brief appearance in the eastern sky, just before sunrise. If you spot it, aim a telescope at Mercury to get a slightly better look. On September 1st, sky watchers in parts of Africa will see the moon pass directly in front of the sun, creating an annular solar eclipse. During an annular solar eclipse, the moon is farther away from Earth than during a total solar eclipse. 
so it appears smaller and doesn't completely cover the sun. A partial solar eclipse will be visible from most of the African continent. The night sky is always a celestial showcase. Explore its wonders from your own backyard. <laughs>